and welcome to eToll Free. Today we are going to talk about the part 2 of the basic troubleshooting guide for eDialer's web phone. I will walk you through the steps on how to troubleshoot and what to check if the timer and check mark are both visible in the eDialer's agent interface but there's no sound coming out of the agent's headset. When this happens, the issue can be from the headset itself or your PC's audio device. First, check the ear and mouthpiece of your headset. Make sure both are working. To do this, you can go to Windows Manage Sound Devices. You can leave your headset only as the output and input device. Then, disable the rest of the audio devices. You can enable back any other audio device later. Second, check your audio settings make sure the headset is set as the default device. Go to Windows Sound Control Panel. Right-click the headset icon you will be using. Then, check if the headset is the default and default communication device. While on Sound Control Panel, go to Communications tab. For the options under Windows Detects Communication Activity, choose Do Nothing. Click Apply and then click OK. If the previous two solutions did not work, unplug your headset. Before doing this, make sure you are logged out of eDialer. Then, plug it back on a different USB port. Give Windows about 1 to 2 minutes to install the audio driver for your headset. Then, log back into eDialer using Chrome Incognito. For any other eDialer concerns, feel free to go to our website, www.etollfree.net, and click the chat support icon, located at the bottom right of the web page. Our friendly eTollFree customer support representatives are ready to help from Monday to Friday from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. Central Standard Time, and on Saturdays from 7 a.m. to 12 noon. If you need to send a ticket after office hours, not a problem, email us at support at etollfree.net, and someone from eTollFree Support will reach out to you as soon as possible.